Hi everybody, this is Karen Stafford with Dr. Stafford's Musical Cures, bringing you another work from children's literature. This book is called Passing the Music Down, and it was written by Sarah Sullivan and illustrated by Barry Root. This book is actually based on two musicians who were 75 years apart in age, but they were the best of friends. And these musicians were Melvin Wine and Jake Crack. They performed fiddle music together. In the book, a young boy travels to the hills of Appalachia to meet an old time fiddle player and ask him to play all his songs. This book can be used as a preference or a reinforcement for several different things. First of all, Moon Liza Jane is mentioned in the book. So you can use this book as part of your practicing whatever concepts that you're teaching with Little Liza Jane, as well as incorporating the game. Several other pieces are also mentioned in this book. And let me see if I can find one. Oh, Peg and All. And Bonaparte's Retreat, You Piney Mountain. So you could take and find recordings of these fiddle pieces and use them as journaling. Also, if you happen to have the books from the New England Dance Masters and the Amadons, where they meticulously write up different steps to different dances, find dances that would fit with the form of some of these fiddle tunes and perform the dances. Because as Peter Amadon has said before, and Mary Alice, some of those dances could be used and had been used with several different melodies. Plus, it's just good to let the kids know about the folk tradition that has been in the United States. Even if it's in Appalachia, this has branched off to much of the rest of the country. And honestly, we're running out of songs that we used to teach our kids and now we're finding out that they're not so good. So let's hone in on the ones that we do know that are good because they're still out there. Just seek them and find them and use books like this to help you. Passing the music down. I would like to see some time or hear from you about how you might have used this book. So please email me at Karen at Dr. Stafford's Musical Cures.com. And if you like, and if you give me permission, I'll share the idea and give you credit. Thanks a lot and see you next week.